day we have people, we have had people who have come with various grievances, grievances pertaining to education, grievances, grievances pertaining to survey plans, various type of uh, issues we try to resolve. And uh, I'm sure many have gone happy. Some we have called back next week when we given time to the officers to to get their files and go through the files also. We will hope that we will resolve the issue by next next Friday. So HGPDA sewage is under control. HGPDA sewage issues are under control. The estimates have been done. I have discussed with the honorable uh, chief minister. He has agreed to immediately approve the tenders of the estimates. So at the end of the day, he is chairman of the uh, civic corporation. So he has assured he will get that. He will get that done. We are moving. Then collector issue. Collector issue will be solved. Also. Collector issue. So I am slightly distracted with old law, but uh, we will resolve this issue. How about the preparation for the thing? I believe works are progressing. Works were delayed because of the monsoon. But I think we are we are trying to make up for the delay. And I, I, I personally believe we will achieve our target of uh, trying to get everything ready by the 10th. Slight delay here and there, so maybe we go to the 15th. But we will deliver on all our targets. Chief Minister is very factual. He wants to ensure that whatever commitments he has made will be delivered in time. Yeah. So anything you have to say about this job scale? I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. But I can only tell you one thing. The job scale, as we call it, is difficult. Why do I say that? I will share with you an example. He was a doctor. Our father came to my house and said that my daughter has been selected for a post in health services. And somebody has come and demanded 30 lakh MRI. <coughs> I know the family personally. So I told the captain, I said, if I was in your place, I would not pay a paise. And I'm confident that she will get a job. She did not pay a price. One year has passed and she's happily working. So many a times I feel uh, these type of issues are, are created. There need not be any truth in them. I'm giving you an example. She may not be willing to come forward and speak with the fear that she may lose her, uh, her job. But this is the truth. So it's very easy for everyone to shout. I was minister <coughs> in my earlier tenure. I think I must have given around 1,200 uh, jobs. But I'm willing to throw a challenge and request anybody who has given me a price to please come forward and uh, expose me. Because I haven't taken a paisa. Having said that, I have examples where people have taken money in my name. And I have called them and I have told them to return that money. Or else I will take action against them. And they return the money. So everything that is coming need not be true. I am again repeating, many a times it is people who move around who try and take advantage and abuse of the system. So don't consider politicians to be that. Uh, so can you give us an update on the NCSCM study? Well, on the NCSCM study, uh, no report has come so far. We expect the report to any time. And uh, then let's go forward. But it's complete. Well, they have completed their study, but we have not received 
Pretty good.